Expeditionary learning is a very different way of thinking about education. Uh, we like to say it's an inch wide and a mile deep rather than an inch deep and a mile wide. And what that means is our kids have the chance to think deeply and revisit and rethink and retool their work. Our kids are taught what personal best looks like, what best work looks like. Craftsmanship, artistry is a major component of our curriculum and that isn't just nice artwork, but it's a well-crafted turn of phrase. They begin with storyboarding, they come up with their first draft, they revisit it, they do peer-to-peer -peer critiques, they do teacher-student critiques, they do self-critiques, and their work evolves uh, over many, many drafts. Edin editing it and um, and like doing a bunch of drafts so we could get it to our final project and it was kind of hard because we had to get it down to two pages and mine was really long but it was really fun. Before the program um, she was Afraid to try new things, she would be in tears if, if something was too complicated, too difficult. Sometimes she wouldn't even try it. Um, but now that she's been here at Summit, she's uh, more, more confident, she's excited. She is willing to tackle those projects that she's not sure how she's going to get there, but she knows that she can get there. Mistakes are celebrated. It's an opportunity to think differently. We use three-month intensive expeditions, engaging content to get our kids thinking about thinking, as well as learning the foundational pieces of early childhood education, early literacy, early science, social science. And we do field work, we don't do field trips. They are prepared to go out, they've got their field journals, they are capturing data while they're in the field, and then they come back into the classroom, draft, revise, critique, um, and get deeper in their learning. We bring those building foundational pieces of early childhood education, weave it into a fabric of super engaging content and then we get the kids out to talk about wolves with experts. They got to hear a pack of wolves howl for the first time a couple weeks ago. It's magic. It's that magic that keeps the fire lit that gets them back into the classroom. They don't use just one um, teaching method for the entire class. They actually custom tailor uh, for each and individual student and that really makes a difference. Every child has the absolute best opportunity to, to excel in the way that they think, the way that they understand, the way they process information. We are so inundated with information right now, our kids need to be able to sift, decipher, re, reform the massive amounts of information that is coming at them. And the gift of Summit is the gift for them to look critically and deeply and across disciplines add information as it comes at them and put it together in new ways to create new knowledge. We don't know what tomorrow's questions will be. We don't know what challenges our society will be facing or the new frontiers of science or computer science in 10 years. But what we know is that these kids are on track to be able to think, think deeply, think critically uh, to engage in what tomorrow's questions are. I think I can change the world.